Good morning. In this video, you are looking into data preprocessing. Here, what is the data preprocessing? In the, in this data preprocessing, what is the data cleaning? Here, how can you handling the missing values? What is the noise data? Uh, how, how can you remove the noise data from the data? And then, what is the data integration? What are the steps in data integration? And then, mathematical approach. Here, the correlation analysis. For the numerical data, how can you handle the correlation analysis? For the categorical data, how can you handle the correlation analysis? And finally, chi square distribution. And then, data transformation. Another important one data transformation. What is the data transformation? And then, in, in this data transformation, you are you are using some of the methods data smoothing aggregation normalization and then generalization like that and then another one here is a data reduction here we have a some techniques are there for um, handling the data reduction here what is the data reduction how can you performing the data cube aggregation attribute sub, um, subset selection dimensionality reduction numerosity reduction finally data discretization and conceptual hierarchy generalization here this is a our agenda this agenda here comes to the first uh, you have to know about the what is the data pre processing here data pre processing here data pre processing is a, an approach or a mechanism that involves the transforming raw data into understandable format of data here transforming the raw data raw data in the sense real world data real world data consists of incomplete data inconsistent data noise data that means it will convert it into understandable high quality data that means improving the, the what is the main aim of data preprocessing is improving the quality improving the quality of data that means human understandable format of data here here the real world data the real world data consists of incomplete incomplete it's an incomplete data in the sense you have you are having that means the data consists of some missing values here that means you have to know about the, how to handle the missing values inconsistent data consistent format of data for example consistent how can you tell inconsistent data for example data birth data birth uh, data birth is a one attribute another attribute is a age data birth equal to data birth is um, 10th march 1983 and then age equal to 10 years that means it is it is called here inconsistent data there is a um, inconsistent noisy data noisy data how can you represent noisy noisy data in the sense it is a noise noise is a variance error error error, error. for example salary equal to minus 2000 or salary equal to minus two two rupees that means that indicates that that's not a that is impossible cases here that is a noisy data here another important kind of data here redundant data here redundant values that means in our data repeated number of records are there repeated number of that means missing values some kind of information miss that means missing value in the sense for example attribute salary not displayed on the board dirty data and then locking in certain that is a different kinds of data real world data here data preprocessing used in database driven applications such as customer relationship management and rule based application that is a neural networks here the quality data how can you quality what is the quality data here the data quality data quality is a perception or assessment of data witness to serve the its purpose in a given text the quality that means the main intention of data preprocessing high quality getting the high quality data here the quality is affected by the way data is entered stored and then managed here we have a quality a characteristics are there accuracy depends uh, satisfy that means if you require quality you should satisfy the accuracy completeness consistent and then high availability and then like that these are all different factors for the um, pre quality of data and then what is the need of data pre-processing what is the need here here what is the necessity 
uh, you are performing the pre-processing. That means where you are performing the pre-processing in the knowledge discovery data, in the knowledge discovery process, the first step here is a pre-processing the data. You are retrieving the data from different different sources. N number of sources uh, data from the databases, from the plot files. That means you are retrieving the data from the different sources and then integrate one place here. Before that, you have to perform in the uh, pre-processing, data pre-processing. Low quality data leads to um, some, yeah, if you have the low quality 